Shut up and sit down. Hi, I'm Mona Seeberger. I'm a pilot, instructor, and a technician. Currently, I'm flying in a business aviation. Unintended flight into IMC is one of the most frequent causes in a helicopter accidents. This video is the first in a series about unintended IMC. In it, I want to cover the actions you can take before takeoff. Whether you're a private pilot or a commercial pilot, it's vital to make the right preparation for every flight. This will really help to avoid unintended IMC encounter. So you can use a risk assessment tool or an app provided by different helicopter manufacturers or even by your own organization to consider and mitigate any risks before you take to the sky. Specifically for weather, know where to get your information and how to interpret it. Plan your route using en route decision points and set your personal minimums. Consider the condition en route that you may encounter and how this affects your ability to avoid terrain and obstacles. Consider also that the situation may change in flight and define a recovery plan if conditions deteriorate unexpectedly. You always have three options. Divert, return to base or land, and live. And if in doubt, delay or cancel the flight. And if you're an operator watching this video, always support your pilots in the decision they make. Commercial pressures, particularly from the passengers, is one of the biggest killers in aviation. If you're IFA qualified, consider an IFA option. On the personal level, the effort of obtaining the instrument rating is really worth it because it gives you more options. The key points are Take the time to prepare every flight to help avoid IMC. Perform a risk assessment to identify any key risks, set personal minima and prepare for the unexpected. And if in doubt, delay the flight. And have a safe flight! <laughs>